listen, you know, we can do something else if you want. Why? I'm having a good time. Well, I mean, I just don't know how much fun it is for a blind person to go to the movies. Brian, blind people go to the movies all the time. We just listen. I might be blind, but my brain has been trained to listen to any movie and know exactly what's happening on screen. Like, I love Titanic. I'm the king of the world! Woo -hoo -hoo! Woo! So, you sure you don't need me to come in? Maybe show you to your bed? Pretty sure I can find it. Thanks. Maybe next time I'll have trouble, though. You might have to help me find it next time. So, there's a next time? Definitely. Great. Well... All right, good night. Ugh, our stupid neighbor's dog barks 24-7. God, I hate dogs. Y you do? Yeah, they're just slobbery, annoying, needy little bastards. I'm just not really a dog person, I guess. Oh, uh, yeah, me neither. Dog people can get pretty annoying. Wow, this is a nice apartment you have. Is this your dog? Yes, isn't he the cutest little cutie wooty? Look how cute he is. Yes, he's very cute. Yes, he's cute. Yes, he's cute, 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 cute. Look at him, look at him, look at him. <laughs> okay. Look at him! Look at that face! Come on, look at that face! You look at him! Look at that <laughs> face! Well, it's getting late. I should probably go. Brian, this is like our sixth date. I'm beginning to feel like you're not attracted to me or something. No, I, oh my god, I'm, I'm so attracted to you. I, so, why haven't we done anything about it? I, I just, you know, sometimes taking things slower is better. Just ask any swath. Hey, is sometimes taking things slower better? Yeah. I just, I like you a lot, and I... I don't want to ruin anything by moving too fast, you know? Because sometimes when you... Hmm. Brian, you never told me you had a beard. I love beards. Oh, <laughs> yeah, no. I, hey, I'm bearding it up over here. <laughs> hey, Brian, would you be cool with meeting my parents? They're in town this weekend, and I thought we could all have dinner. Uh, sure. Are they... Are they driving themselves? <laughs> if you're asking if they can see, yes. And since you can see, why don't you tell me how these look? Uh, they look pretty damn great. Then why don't you tell me how they feel? Uh, next time. Some things are worth waiting for. Wow, you're really a true gentleman. Yep, <coughs> not too many of us left. <coughs> Stewie, I need your help. What? What is it? I have a crisis situation here. Kate wants me to meet her parents. Hey, guys. I'm just gonna... gonna take this. Thank you. What the hell am I gonna do? All right, all right, just calm down. Calm down? We're all supposed to have dinner tomorrow night, and her parents are gonna see that I'm a dog. Yeah! Ow! Oh! Ow! Yeah! Ow! Don't worry, Brian, I'll come up with something. Remember, I'm the guy who came up with the choreography to Showgirls. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Elizabeth, darling, too much hands, not enough hips. Can I just show you? One, two, three, four, I'm dancing from my vagina. One, two, three, four, I'm grinding, I'm grinding. Orgasmize, orgasmize, and we're done. Oh, hi, you must be Kate. I'm Brian's nurse. He's had a little accident, I'm afraid. Oh, my God, Brian, are you okay? Oh, don't worry, I'm fine. I'm just sort of bandaged up right now. What happened is this one's a hero is what happened. Rescued two children from a burning building. Can you imagine? Not quite in time. They were both horribly burned. Had that sort of creme brulee face going on now. But he saved their lives. Oh, my God, Brian. I know, right? So noble. Plus, he's the only one of my patients to never ask me for handwork. Such a gentleman. Never even tried anything when I'm giving him a sponge bath. And I'm very thorough. I will wash the abdominals. Not all nurses do, but I do. And yes, sometimes I graze it. But you know what? I'm a healthcare professional. It's what I do. It's my work. It's important to me. And this one respects that. What's that smell? It, it smells like wet dog in here. That is the, the smell of backed up, unreleased genital essence. As I said, he's been an amazing gentleman. Well, I'd like to propose a toast to Brian and Kate. What's that thumping noise? It's your tail. Stop wagging your tail. I can't help it. Do something. Uh, uh, damn it. I meant hold it, not cut it off. You 
you weren't specific. I've never done this before. Uh, what the hell are you? Cauterizing your tail. Trust me, I'm a nurse. Uh, what the hell? You're not going to stick me with that thing? I don't think that's a real nurse. Just hold still. Pretend you're at the vet. Vet? I hate the vet. There's a dog in here. Yes, okay? There's a dog in here. I'm a dog. <gasps> I'm so sorry, Kate. I, I know you hate dogs, and I I wanted to tell you. I, I really did, but I, I just thought... I, I thought if we got to know each other better first, you'd eventually be able to see past it. <laughs> see? And I, I, just, I really care about you, and I really want this to work, and I, I'm, I'm so sorry I didn't tell you before. You know what, Brian? I could have gotten over the fact that you're a dog, because I really do care about you, and I feel like we had a connection. But I can't get over the fact that you lied to me. You screwed up, Brian. And now you're gonna have to watch me walk out that door. <laughs>